It is now time to compete in part four of my Born to be a Millionaire Farewell Special. Sorry for not uploading the third part, third of, for the, the up, not uploading the fourth and fifth parts uh, much earlier. But here we go. Part four, here we go. Let's try and win a million dollars tonight. to be a millionaire kids edition okay are you playing a one player okay I wanna act like a white hey it's bag. Regis what's the 411 on your name hey I didn't ask you to enter my name try this one instead what is he gonna put in <laughs> oh what happened darn it it just Oh, Twitch. That stinking Twitch thing. Alright, here we go. I thought it. Time I thought the to game stop crashed, chilling and check out your first go. question. For $100. In the magazine highlights for children, what two characters tell us are do's and don'ts? I don't see what the kids have to say. I don't know that magazine. What? Oof, that's not much help, is it? I'm gonna give you 15 more seconds to come up with a final answer. I'll go with that. Goof is gone. Banking on the kids I'll in our pool, another, fine. I'll try a third game if we, this is wrong. You're obviously oh, pretty right. sharp, that's correct. Wow, the from almost, uh, lost, I almost lost back there. Very game. cool, Good you're luck. off to a great start. Right. Here's question number two, coming at you. For $200. In painting Washington crossing the Delaware, how is Washington shown crossing the Delaware? On a boat, in a boat. A, final answer. You seem sure answer A won't let you down. It's in a boat. You're obviously yeah. pretty sharp, that's correct. Delaware River. Delaware River. Delaware River. Delaware River. You're two for two, but those questions were nothing. Your $300 question is bound to be a little bit harder. According to the saying, Dave, for a long time, you do it till the cows come home. C, final answer. You're thinking C is styling. Okay. Cool, that's right. Three in a row and three hundred dollars. Now for five hundred bucks. Take a look at this one. Okay, for five hundred dollars, here we go. An educational tool used by teachers to rapidly drill students on facts and figures is called flashcard. Final answer. You think answer B will help you ace this one, huh? You are wicked right. You're $500 richer, but if you can get this next one, you'll double For your money. $1,000. A stag is the male of which of these animal species? Um, a red deer, A, final answer. Jumping right in on answer A, fine. Nice going, you're right. One thousand dollars in the bank. Like that. You've got just you. ten questions left until we add a lot more zeros to that number. 
for 2,000. Here we go. Which of these TV series was based on books by Laura Ingalls Wilder? Little House on the Prairie, see final answer. You want to select answer C? No problem. Yep. Smooth move, you got it. Hiding from view again. 2,000 bucks and counting. Now, here comes your four thousand dollar question. All right, four grand. The island of Nantucket lies due south of what cape? That is Cape Cod, B final answer. You're ready to roll with answer B, fine. You are yes. wicked right. I remember getting that question. Hey, stop doing that. Four thousand dollars. Want to make it eight thousand? <laughs> Just answer this Eager. next question. Come on. Mob most resembles which of these colors? I want a 50 50. Let your choice is 50 50. Computer, go ahead, remove two of the answers, making sure the correct answer is still on the screen. Well, we narrow the possibilities just a little bit here. Hmm. C purple final answer. Ready to commit to answer C already? Good. Nice job, kid. You're right. Seven away from the million. Eight in a row and eight thousand dollars. We're about to get into the big money here, so they're gonna get a lot tougher. Check out your sixteen thousand dollar question. All right. For six, seven away from the million. Jackknife dive. Touch their toes. B, final answer. You're saying Ants of B looks pretty fresh. Okay. Hug their knees is a cannonball. Smooth move, you got it. For $32,000. You're doing great. If you could keep this up for one more question, you'll reach the second safe haven. Let's get to it. Which of these famous American women was, a, was born a slave in the early 1800s? That is Harriet Tubman, A final answer. So, you're cool with answer A, fine. I think. Nice yep. job, kid. You're right. That was great of Harry and Peter. So, but I got it. $32,000. You know, you must be the smartest kid in your class. You've managed to get to the second safe haven of the game, and that million bucks is just five questions away. Let's play. <laughs> For $64,000. And it's a free guess. Use you need to power up for this question. I've got the right kid to call. Luckily, we've been given a phone number of his favorite arcade. Oh, arcade! Happy fun time, arcade. Hello. Hey, it's Regis Philbin trying to get a hold of Brian. Is he lurking around that video machine in there? Brian, it's him again. What a downer. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, Brian, it's Regis calling. It's pretty loud over there. Can you hear me? Oh, well, of course. This is nothing. How's it going, Regis? Fine, fine. You know, we've got a millionaire question just for kids, and we could use your opinion. Can you help? Well, I hope it's about video games. It's definitely 30 not. 30 seconds on the clock, please. Here we go. This is totally not about video games. 
man, I'm gonna drop the ball here. I don't know it. Can you at least oh, give us a guess? It a guess? It's uh, well, Henry Hudson. Uh, okay, let's see. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Okay, it's B. Yeah. Good. You're sure you're right. Good guy. Good guy. Do I sound sure? What are you thinking? I Good said, enough. That's I thought Henry Hudson Goodbye. at first yeah, when the question oh, came up. He says answer B. What are you gonna do? B, Henry Hudson, final answer. Is that like totally your final answer? Just to let you know, guys, each You're game is You're thinking our phone a friend is right. Each okay. Part, each part of this farewell special is two games long, just in case you guys don't know from weeks and months. Smooth last move, month. you got it. All right, four away from the million. You know, you're a genius. I hope you do this well in your math tests. Let's see if you can keep up the good work with your $125,000 question. I got passing grades from 95 to 100 on my massage school. I'll be all right. <laughs> In Roman numerals, what is D divided by X? Okay. D is five, M is, D is 500, X is 10. C is a hundred. M is a thousand. He's five. Uh, L, final answer, B. Is that like totally your final answer? Answer B is it. Fine. You are wicked, right? <laughs> Three away. Oh, you've really got the goods, kid. This next question is worth $250,000. Take a look. In Lincoln's Gettysburg Address, four score and seven years ago refers to what historical event? Declaration of Independence. B, final answer. Is that really your final answer? You think answer B will help you ace this one, huh? I play this game much better than Aubrey has. Cool, that's right. <laughs> Two away for 500,000. You're on a rampage here. Nothing can stop you. Now let's see how you do with a really tough question that's worth $500,000. All right, I think I had a nightmare about this question once on the same game. Which of these actresses is the daughter of Academy Award-winning actor John Voight? That is Angelina Jolie, final answer. Is that like totally your final answer? Please. I don't want it to be deja vu all over you again. You think Anthony will keep you a happy camper, don't you? Last Fine. Month. Nice yeah! going, you're right. Got that one. All right. Are you ready, guys? Okay. For one Get million your thinking dollars. cap on now. Here comes your one million dollar question. And the better news is we have another game to play after this. For one million dollars. Which of these ancient peoples worship Bast, the cat goddess? C, final Is answer. Is that like totally your for final it. answer? You're thinking C is styling. Okay. I said 
final answer. You're obviously million pretty dollars. sharp, that's correct. You got it right, kid, you're a millionaire. Sorry, I pissed you off, Green, this because I used your name. Hey, you just won a million dollars. How awesome is that? Not that a millionaire needs to brag. That wouldn't be cool. But of course you worked hard to win all that phony money. So go ahead, brag all you like. And feel free to use the cheat code below the next time you play. Later. <laughs> <laughs> all right. That's okay. All right, let's, we're just getting started here. So let's play again. Hey kid, it's Regis. Just How about letting us go with the ribbon? Now, on to the hot seat. Time to stop chilling and check out your first question. Uh, tuna, the final answer. Is that like totally Chicken the final the answer? Tuna. Going with answer B for sure. Okay. Smooth move, you got it. Okay, you waste the first one, but they're gonna get much tougher now. Let's see what's in store for you for your two hundred dollar question. Met two fret fifty three and uh, Daniel or Daniel wants to play uh, my final part. How do you play a harmonica? Blow into it. A final answer. Quick to press answer A. All right. Hey, you're right. Two down, 13 to go. Hey, no sweat here, right? We'll see. If something is ship-shaped, it's best to describe as which of the following. Um, in perfect order, final answer. You're thinking answer C is pretty sweet, eh? Ship shape. Nice job, yep. kid. You're right. You're on the board with three hundred dollars. Let's see how you do with the next question. Kikarupa. Which of these is a stringed instrument? Tuba, clarinet, cello, kettle drum. C kettle. C cello. Final answer. You Drum think is, uh, answer C is pretty tight, don't you? Too bad. Ooh, Turn that's right. And and You're doing a fat job here. I'm not. Let's fat. keep it going and take a look at your one thousand dollar question. <laughs> Which of these pop parts moves the fastest? The second hand. C. Final answer. Final? Pretty sure that C will do the trick, huh? Nice going, you're right. Man, you breezed your way through the early ones, but now that you've reached the first safe haven, they're gonna get a lot tougher. Which of these signs of the zodiac is represented by a ram? I'm gonna use a little light right here. Cool, let's see what our young audience thinks. Lots of differing opinions in this crowd. Go ahead, take another 15 seconds to think about it. I'm actually gonna go with Aries, final answer, because Taurus is a cow. Going final your own answer. way on this one, fine. 
Be glad you dismissed the yeah. audience's opinion because you're right. Hey kid, you're really on a roll. Now let's see how you do with your $4,000 question. Which of these patriotic symbols did the U.S. astronauts leave on the moon's surface in 1969? American flag. See, final answer. Pretty sure that C will do the trick, huh? I guess you could say that answer was the bomb. You're right. Hey, you're really up on this stuff. Let's see how you do with your $8,000 question. Just chowing on my uh, banana bread that I just made. It's really good. Roach of the following is not a standard piece on the ch in the chess set. That's canon. C, final answer. You're thinking C is styling. Okay. Canon is a monopoly token. I guess you could say that it. Hold on. I just gotta get rid of this. Something was bugging me. Nothing I like better than moist. And so was the bomb. Banana You're bread. right. Hey, you're quite the expert. That's eight grand so far. Two more and you'll hit the next safe haven. Let's play. Seven away from the million. For 16,000. Oh, that's uh, Mbop. See, final answer. Bebop Alula is Gene Vincent. You're thinking C is styling. Okay. That's right. You're doing great. If you could keep this up for one more question, you'll reach the second safe haven. Let's get to it. For $32,000, let's play. Neverland Ranch is the name of what singer's home? Oh, that's uh, Michael Jackson. B, final answer. Is that your final answer? B is not only a decent grade, but your answer for this question. Okay. Nice job, kid. You're right. You know, you must be the smartest kid in your class. You've managed to get to the second safe haven of the game, and that million bucks is just five questions away. Let's play. In the first two Jurassic Park movies, what is the occupation of character Dr. Ian Malcolm? Uh, that is a paleontologist. Final answer. Final? Jurassic Park, paleontologist. They You're going to take dinosaurs. a chance on answer A. Uh. As if. That's totally incorrect. Here's what you should have selected. It was a mathematician. Dumb. Dumb. <laughs> well, you it managed to get to two thirds of the whatever. way to the million, so you only get two. All right, I'll see you all later for part five, the last part in our seg in our uh, farewell special. If I can get this off. All right. All right, see you all later for part five.